Hi guys, what's up? It's Joel Pitt here, back with another video, and in this video, it'll be for Love Island 2024, Season 11, Episode 9. I'll leave a link down below to Episode 8. Of course, there's going to be spoilers. So without further ado, let's get on with it. So the time has come for Mimi and Omar to decide what they were going to do. They had a chat, and they decided they were going to steal. So Mimi decided to go with Ayo, and Omar went for Uma. Um, but I thought he would have gone for Patsy because, you know, there was really that flirting. But then I don't know if he was on that level, if he was the same as Patsy. I mean, Patsy was going full in, but Omar, I think, was sort of bringing it back a little, you know, not going in too much. Um, the girls and the boys, they spoke after. Um, Omar and Patsy spoke and she was saying that, you know, our oh, chats are better better than yours and Uma, to be honest. Uh, Patsy and Mimi spoke. Then Uma, Mimi and Ayo spoke together. I think basically there was some stuff that, you know, that's probably not been said or something. And they want to know what's going on. Are they on equal level? That sort of thing. Um, some people were watching on the beanbags. But then Ayo was saying, you know, I'm telling you everything, I'm equal with you both, all that. Then, after the chat, Mimi brought the speech thing, basically, with Uma saying, oh, if you didn't pick um, Ayo before, he had a speech lined up for me and all this. Um, Kira and Nicole in bed, they cuddled, Ronnie and Jess spooned. Ayo and Mimi kissed. Well, you know, he said he was going to keep it equal, but he's kissed her. And then everyone else slept. Jess and Uma spoke. Mimi told Jess and Nicole about the kiss. Well, he did feel right in the moment, but, you know, if he says he's going to be equal, like, she shouldn't be doing that stuff. And he should tell people, which he probably did, because Ayo then spoke to Kieran and Joey what he should do. Then Jess pulled Ayo... You know, asked, oh, did you kiss Mimi and all this? Um, then, yeah, went to the boys, boys again. Um, then called Uma over, told Uma about the kiss. She walked off after, you know, he told all about it. Then we had a challenge called On Job. Basically, the girls they had, would come out of the lift in this work uniform. They would sit at the desk. They would pick a green folder and a red folder. The green folder has a saucy sex position, which then they have to pick someone to do. And the red folder contains a negative statement, which they have to match up to someone. And then after, they have to chuck a T over them. So, first up, Harriet. She got standing doggy and did it with Ronnie. And then the next one, the negative statement, was office gossip. So, she went for Kieran. Um, Patsy was next. Um, her book... Her sex position was butterfly. She would have picked Omar, but he didn't pick her. So then he picked. She picked Mumve. Um, then the next one, a disciplinary action needed, went for Ronnie. Uma was next. Went for the boat. Well, the sex position was the boat. And yeah, instead of going for Io, he went for Sean. And really interesting. Surprised us, you know there. As he does, he's a dark horse, isn't he? He's, he's just not had the look yet, which I'm rooting for. You know, I'm hoping he does find a connection soon. Because um, everyone's saying he is a gentleman. Um, lack of accountability went to Ayo. Then we had Nicole, um, who got the eagle. Of course, went for Kieran. Uh, next one, not a team player, Omar, she went for. Mimi had reverse, reverse cowgirl, went for Ayo. Violation in the workplace, um, she went for Ronnie. Samantha had the wheelbarrow, went for Joey. And then negative attitude, went to Kieran. Jess had the rocking chair, which she chose Sean. So that's two for Sean. He's really getting it, you know. Like, Jess is slowly gravitating towards Sean. And I think, you know, if Ronnie doesn't make his decision, or goes for Harriet, or doesn't know she's going to be like look i'm leaving you ronnie i'm going with Sh sean or i'm going to build that connection with him because you you're starting to mess me about um then inappropriate behavior of course went to ronnie 
Um, and then that was it for that challenge. Then Jess and Ronnie spoke after. Io took Mimi to the terrace. Don't know why terrace. Like, literally, why could you not take her anywhere else? Because if you take them to the terrace or the hideaway, you know, they're probably going to kiss. Um, Uma was actually annoyed at this point, as she should be. Um, she was so far away, Mimi, to Io. And then, I don't know why. Like, why don't you come closer to that sort of thing? Um, then they kiss, of course. Uh, Ronnie and Harriet Ronnie and Harriet spoke. Then Harriet and Patsy spoke. Then we had to, on the day, head to the app. Vote for your favourite couple. This was um, Tuesday, I believe. And it already closed at, like, 15 minutes before the um, show finished. And then I think that was... That might have been announced the next... Well, they said later this week, but it's probably normally the next day. But, yeah. Anyway, that is all for this video. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one.